Come on out, old buddy. How you doing? Not good. Not good. Let's see this. Uh oh, boys and girls, this doesn't look good. Big Al, how are you? I'm mad. You're mad? Well, you want to tell me about it? Yeah. Okay, that's not fair. Mm -hmm. Can I tell him that part? Boys and girls, somebody was not kind to Big Al. They made fun of him, and others laughed. And so your plan with that is to do what, Big Al? Clobber. Clobber. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you think that's going to help? It'll help me. It'll help you feel better. No, it'll help you feel better. I'm going to argue that. What? I don't think it will be, Gail. Well, you might think, but Big Al, what you are doing when you do that is becoming like people who are mean. Whoa. It's never the way to a happy heart to hurt others. Never? Never. Whoa. Jesus invites us, Big Al, to do the work of letting go, of forgiving. He joking, he not joking. Because he knows there's life that way that wouldn't come any other way. My idea, what? First clobber, then forgive. First clobber and then forgive. Mm -hmm. That's not how it works, Big Al. Mm -hmm. you, you just set that down. All right. And Big Al, I'm sorry that you were treated that way. Not right. It's not right. And it's okay to be hurt. You probably want to use your words to have a conversation with that person. And if they don't get it, talk to someone else to help make sure that doesn't keep happening. But Big Al, don't become like that. No, Big Al, let's be like Jesus. That's the way to happiness. That alone is the way to happiness. I'll try. Bye. And boys and girls, if anybody has ever made fun of you or hurt you or picked on you, I am so sorry. That's not right, and you don't deserve it. And I pray that you won't become like that. There's a better way, a way that gives joy and hope and meaning, the way of Jesus. <laughs>